It's game day, and Evil Ascend and the MFL welcome you to the jungle. Welcome to the jungle, Grim. It gets worse here every day. You learn to live like an animal in the jungle where we play. What the hell are you talking about? That shit just pops into his head and comes out through his mouth hole. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Brain Washington Cadavers battle, the Cincinnati Mangles. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And that was a huge run right there. Hey, speaking of huge runs, Rich, why don't you put a cork in that gravy big of yours, huh? Hey, he's I'm dying up here. Third down and ten. Ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. Nice catch. And he turns on the afterburners. Put return. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps on sides, trying to mute him. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell gonna take it anymore. <laughs> First down in a mile. Oh, I love this dirty trick. Feet by fo fum And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and a lot. Hot one, hot two. That's a killer. It was right there and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two. Ten-yard pick up there. Normally a first down, but here, he's just making up ground. Yeah, like the way the commission makes 
God knows. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And he's got a chance for a good return here. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose! Unless you're in a sleeping contest. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Second down and six. First down. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit! Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And he 
picks up 10 on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly is overrated, Trim. Second down in inches. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know. I hate those zebra men. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. down and forever. And the quarterback had no time to throw and the defense gets a big sack. Second down in a mile. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. You know this and the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you say greatest hits? Well, Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. No! Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Oh, 
He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot two. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Sure. Ain't nothing worse than wasting a good explosive. Second down and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver, knocking down the... It's a touchdown! <laughs> the offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. That's really put the fun. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. Oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. First and ten. Fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the ball is lateral to his team. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, 
win, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. That's a nice catch for five yards. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. Second down and two. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. And he breaks away. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And that'll be their final timeout. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. First and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And he takes a time out here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. <laughs> the quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Oh, boy. And that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. And out comes the most underrated position in football. The mighty punter. And he booted a high arching rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got hit by a car. Oh, he just got crushed. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsanto.
Satan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the halftime show. It's still anyone's game here as we start the third quarter. Oh, I missed it, Ben. I was out in the concourse grabbing some food. And there was this mutant leopard line, and he left in an angry hop. Why did he leave, Bricks? Well, people kept dipping their chips in him. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. and catch. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stopped after three. They usually stop me after The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Oh, and that's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. Can he be proud of that? And it's first and ten. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. First and ten. That ball just 
slice through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. That'd be fantastic. Oh, big catch, big run, big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. Mr. Big for Bray Brown with a ball and then fall out. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. No. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Ma, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Boom! And that'll be second down and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, man, what a throw. Sonic Blast just cleared the field for... Oh, with the Brain Scrambler! And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the jugger. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. The Simpson Nasty Mangles pulverize the opposition today and win by forfeit. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? Well, I paid for admission. I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, man, I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the now. You know Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.